Buju, Kinamagi and Ine Ireland Indigenous, and welcome to this production of Support Coach Television. This feature, Sleep and Dreams, the full text reading. This video will be with the first, second, and third read post. After the first two reads, you will return to the Google Classroom for instructions in other subjects. After the third read, you will complete the comprehension check. Sleep and dreams. People spend about one third of their life sleeping. But what exactly is sleep? And what are dreams? Throughout human history, people have been attempting to figure out the meaning, if any, of their dreams. What is sleep? Sleep is the name given to the natural state of rest that people and animals enter to, into on a regular basis. Scientists do not actually know the exact purpose of sleep. When compared with being awake, however, it appears that sleep provides the body and the mind with a period of relaxation and recuperation, just as a vacation helps in the recovery from everyday stress. Studies show that people sleep between six and nine hours a night. Yet in recent years, there has been an increase in the number of people who get less than six hours of sleep. Naturally, they gain fewer of the benefits of sleep, such as feeling rested and refreshed. People who don't get enough regular sleep can develop a condition called problem sleepiness. This means that they feel sleepy while they are awake. People afflicted by problem sleepiness can experience memory loss, irritability, fatigue, or difficulty concentrating. These symptoms impact activities as varied as workplace productivity and driving. The sleep cycle. When people go to sleep at night, they begin a sleep cycle. The cycle is made up of different stages. Each stage is refined by a certain, defined by a certain level of brain activity. As a person's sleep gets deeper, the activity of the brain slows down. Stage one is the lightest sleep, and stage four is the deepest sleep. The two main stages of sleep are REM and NREM. REM stands for rapid eye movement. During REM sleep, the eyes periodically twitch and jerk under the eyelids. Other than the eyes, the muscles are totally relaxed. The body is still, and the person is very difficult to arouse. NREM stands for non-rapid eye movement. During NREM, the eyes move hardly at all, and the body's muscles can still move. During the night, a normal sleep cycle consists of four to six periods of NREM and REM stages. Dreams. Dreams are visions that people have when they're asleep. The content of a dream is unique to the person who is dreaming, yet there are images that appear in many people's dreams. For example, many people dream that they are flying, Dreams can seem fantastic and bizarre or very realistic. Scientists have not come to an agreement on what causes people to dream the images they do. And you see this graphic is an example of the sleep cycle for a normal adult. The gray areas show NREM sleep. Not all sleep cycles are the same. This person, for example, woke up twice during the night. Scientists think that, that something during REM may trigger a big dream to begin. The richest and most dynamic dreams occur during REM. While a person is dreaming, the parts of the brain controlling intelligence and reasoning turn off. In contrast, the parts controlling emotion and memory remain active. This helps explain why dreams sometimes have a mix of memories and strong emotions, such as fear or anxiety. The meaning of dreams. Dreams are interpreted in, in numerous and varied ways. Some people believe dreams predict the future. Others think dreams are a way of dealing with past trauma. And some believe dreams can help people understand how to handle problems in their present lives. Modern dream interpretation began with the work of Sigmund Freud, an Austrian physician who studied dreams. Freud's theory was that dreams reveal what people secretly think, want, and fear. When people are awake, he believed, they repress their true feelings and wants. Because dreams occur during sleep, 
they are unrepressed expressions of desire or fear. Today, ideas about dream interpretation vary wildly, but for many, Freud's ideas are still the foundation. Both sleep and dreams continue to be important areas of study for scientists. Doctors are trying to raise awareness of the dangers of problem sleepiness. Psychologists and therapists are using their patients' dreams to help them solve their personal problems. This wraps up the reading for this session. If this was the first two reads, you may move on to another topic. If this is your third read, please return to the Google Classroom for the comprehension check. There will be an additional video that is a read aloud of the comprehension check. That video is for those students who desire it and is not required. The comprehension check Google form or the paper copy, however, are required. Miigwech. Have a minogizigad. Minwa. Mama Pete.